Welcome back to Operation Pixel. Uh, so I was just looking at the menu here uh, between episodes because I suddenly remembered that there was more stuff I could level up than just uh, these guys, which I can't get to yet. Wait, why is this one blue? Can I get this one? Even though it's past that, that threshold thing? Oh, no, it's just unlocked because it was unlocked by story stuff. Okay, that makes sense. Um, but yeah, I remembered that there was this other page here of upgrade stuff I could do. And then I realized that I have a whole bunch of these points saved up. Not not like a ton. I can't upgrade my elf shot more, for example. Uh, but I could snag this extra sword rune. Uh, an extra bow rune. Um, I still have a bunch left. Uh, let's get some more sword rune. Another bow rune. Another dagger rune. And I can get some more focus. And then maybe I'll get that health next, because... Boy, do I need it. Uh... That being said, now that I have more runes... Oh, it's showing me. Maybe. Oh, it was sitting there for some... Oh, maybe it was going on and I just missed it, because they're really tiny. And I was looking at the blade, because I was assuming that's where they were going to be. Uh, so let's get that health rune on there I got before. Yep, there's the runes. Ha 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 ha. All the runes. Um. Only have one here. Oh, chance to recover focus. Fred shot kills. That's pretty cool. And for the dagger, we already had one extra for it. I probably don't have a third rune. Oh, I do have a third rune. Uh, for grab shank kills. Huh. It's a grab shank kill. <laughs> I mean, I know how to grab, but I haven't tried to stab somebody after that. Interesting. Maybe I'll have to give that a go. Alright, well, since we're here... Um... Hmm. Hmm, hmm, hmm. Oh, I need to blow my nose. Ugh. I don't want to... <laughs> I don't want to sneeze. Not a big fan of sneezing. I also don't like blowing my nose during the show. Fortunately, my allergies haven't been too bad lately. Uh, there's been some episodes where it was just like, oh, this is just going to be awful. We got to record them, but it's going to be a bad time. All right. Uh... Oh, so this gave a crap ton of points. I think I might swing around the edge here. I might I might do like a bit of a loop here, up this way, and then try to come back down here and go for that. I think that's what I'm gonna do. That's my plan. I don't know if it's good, but it's what I feel like doing. Oh, I'm going the wrong way already. This way. Do do do. There we go. We're free. Intel's up ahead. Ah, uh, I don't need to restore the health, but I have noticed that there's a uh, some things there, like challenges you can do. All right, intel on a captain. Who do I want intel on? Let's let's take let's take one of these other guys back here. Uh, who's this guy? Ulrock the Chunky. Uh, reveling in the supremacy of the Uruk. Uh, what do we know about him? <clears throat> Vulnerable to combat finishers and ranged attacks. Ooh. I like the idea of them being rave vulnerable to ranged attacks, because it means that uh, if I get a good angle, I can take them out in one shot from a distance and not have to fight them. Because fighting is dangerous for my health. Uh, continually heals rapidly. Oh, man. So you pretty much gotta kill him quick. Okay. Uh, let's get out of sight here. For, for these guys see me. I'm thinking they're gonna start looking for me here. They're gonna find that body. <laughs> oh wait, there was an artifact there. 
There it is. Good. Whatever's coming our way, we'll be ready for it. There we go. Wait, that's right. We get items. Ooh, it's a book. How did this book survive being buried in the rain? <laughs> it's kind of fun shifting it around like that. Uh, the Rangers of Gondor, not just powerful warriors, they also perform a host of duties throughout the kingdom. Depending on the circumstances, a ranger may be called upon to serve as a mediator, a judge, a medic, and, on occasion, even a teacher. Rangers have been known to carry basic reading primers, and during their stays in villages uh, where opportunities for learning are scant, to select a few favored pupils and show them how to read and write. That's nice. Sounds Let's play this memory. Why must you put me through this, Hergon? There's no one to blame but yourself. You begged me to teach you the words in my books. I regret that now. What use is the page here in Mordor? Here, look at this. It's a note for you. My love. Be my knife. Try again. Knife? Or... Wife. Wife? Yes, Hyrgon. I am yours. I guess these are just memories of, of people. Not necessarily... Because I thought these were going to be the uh, memories of, of the... Um, Wraith dude, but it's starting to seem like we've given the there are a bunch of uh, memories to escape Mordor to reach the safety of Gondor. And Many we can people. draw the eye of our enemy. As long as we can hold his gaze, we can buy time for Middle Earth. The men from okay. Uh, all right. So next point of interest, I want that sword. We got a bit of a shanty town here. This is pretty cool looking, actually. I've seen a lot of shanty towns in games, but most of them aren't giant 3D playgrounds. Let's get restocked on those. I don't know if I was low, but now I'm not. There's that guy. Oh, he fell. <laughs> Alright, we got someone else in that tower over there. Oh, but I don't need to worry about him. Herbine needs nearby. Where? It's probably down to the ground. I'm not gonna look for it. I wanna do this. Oops. Into the pit! Uh? He was to be cut down to show that he was not immortal. He slew every enemy sent at him, including his captors. Alright, well, we'll give it a try. <laughs> oh, God. This, this actually sounds pretty hard. <laughs> and getting a hit streak of 100? I mean, maybe? Let's focus primarily on defense here. I'll try to pay extra attention to counters. I want that, that 100 streak chain! For whatever it's worth. Let's kill that guy. Cool. Whoa! Ah, I screwed up my counter. Oh, that's what combo finishers are. I just realized, well, maybe not combo finishers, but melee finishers or whatever. Or things like this. Cool. Alright, I'm getting better at this. Alright. 
Oh jeez, they're just gonna keep coming here. There we go. Oh, that, did that restart my chain? I mean, it might have, because it like requires you to have like an eight-hit chain. Whoa! Dang! Whoa! Suddenly, I was trying to remember what the uh, wraith strike thing was, because I assumed that would give a whole bunch of like combo stuff. Whoa! Yeah, I need to remember that finisher there, because that's that's gonna be huge. Whoa! Oh crap. Oh crap. Ah, oh, I pressed the wrong button! Soon, Uruk command more Uruks! Kill more men! <sighs> well, now he's a legend. <laughs> This is also a cool function of the game. I mean, I really wish I could just restart from that challenge and just try again. It's probably going to start me at my last tower or something. And now he's in the army. Like a jerk. Oh, I know that's right. Time is passing, so... Things are happening. People are getting promoted, moving up in the ranks. I don't really want to see all this. I just died. I'm not feeling great about it, game. Like, you don't have to freaking make me spend half an hour watching the orcs have a good time. Alright. Uh, so we're gonna, we're gonna have to head back to that map, probably. With all these towers of silver, they are lights to guide us in the land of shadow. Where all other lights <sighs> may fail. Pale reflections of Man. Alright, well we're gonna give it another go. The two I don't give up that easy. Memories of a lost kingdom. Alright. That's still a bummer though, like it's hard to fight that many orcs. Uh Forgot these guys were here. Oh man, there's like a whole patrol there. Can I use the beehive? <laughs> Thank you. That'll save me some time. Okay. Uh. Yeah, it's, like, again, it's an interesting mechanic, but honestly speaking, like, at the very least, in a challenge, right? Not when, like, I'm, like, if I was roaming the field, right, and I picked a fight, and I died in it, like, that, that's fine, whatever. Send me back to a checkpoint. But when I'm in a challenge, like, I just kind of want to try a second time, not get freaking interrupted to run back here. I don't know. It's it's a small complaint. Uh, and, and, you know, it's not gonna lower my opinion of this game unless I keep dying a lot. But... Ooh. Okay, there it is. X plus A. Oh, wait, no, that's that. Which is still good, but... I'm trying to remember what the uh, little like hit streak thing I could do was. All right, we're just gonna try and keep this up. Need to stay at the top of my game. Whoa, that was close. Oh man, it killed my hit streak. What? I really want to know what's killing my hit streak here, because. Uh, I haven't been hit yet. Whoa! 
Okay, that time I got hit. That time it's fair. That would end my hit streak. <laughs> like getting to a like it's only a bonus objective, but getting to that hundred would be super cool. This is requiring like all my focus right now because there's just so many guys on screen. Uh, so sorry if I'm not going to talk too much during this or not make any reasonable points. Uh, the win away. Oh man, can't counter both of them. Um, there comes like a certain point in games where uh, sometimes talking about things actually makes you just better at playing them. I forget what it was. There was one game we were playing on Operation Pixel here where uh, Ark had me talking about, like, uh, Japanese history or something like that. Because uh, it's something that I know a little bit about. And uh, it was kind of like I started playing better while talking about it than when I wasn't talking about it. And he was like, hey, come on, keep talking about Japanese mythology. It keeps you focused. <laughs> or Japanese history, sorry. Um, I don't know that much about... Japanese mythology, unfortunately. Um. Ooh. Uh. But yeah, no, I just. It is weird because I'm actually doing quite well right now. Uh, while I'm talking, as as I suggested moments ago, even though it's distracting, somehow yapping away is keeping me in the game here pretty well. Um, let's just keep killing these guys. I'm up to 55. That's almost certainly the highest combo I've had in this game. Mostly because I'm either dead by now or combat's now. Oh, dang it. Alright, so I think... Let's try something else here. I want to try... Ooh. Let's try that. It probably doesn't do a lot of damage to them. I'm guessing it just, like, mostly stuns them, and is mostly useful for wiping out ghouls. Woo! I wonder if I, like... I wonder if ghouls are always gonna typically come in, in those sorts of numbers? Cause that's, uh... Woo! That was a lot of enemies. Ah! Alright, I'm losing my cool. I need to talk about Japanese stuff more. <laughs> um, oh. Was it that I had to get like 50 kills here? Yeah, I did. Okay. Still working on it. Ah. Losing it. Okay, so you can counter two people at once, it looks like. Ah, crap. This isn't good. X. Alright. Need to focus more. More focus. More focus. If only that was that easy, right? Like, it's still easy to make mistakes. And there's a lot going on here. And I'm not that good at this game. So. Uh. I don't know. The question is, like, what else is there to talk about? Uh. I mean, I did want to talk more about, like, Lord of the Rings and the movies. Like, because. I mean, you know. I don't know. Whoa! Didn't double counter. Tried, but it wasn't quick enough. Whoa! God dang it! Okay, well, this is my second time, so... Yeah, I already know about this. There we go. Alright, I... <laughs> pretty much can't afford to take too many more hits here, because I don't know... how long it takes for those last chances to recover, if they do. So 
I mostly just need to make sure that I stay alive. Let's keep killing these guys. Oh, I'm so close. I need one more guy. Oh, there we go. Oh boy. What a fight. Um. Oh man. <laughs> Alright, weapon upgrades. Let's see. Yeah, you get the points. Devastatingly powerful stability for the sword. And the Storm of Urfail, Urfail will allow you to rampage for a short time, enabling unlimited executions. Oh, that's pretty rad. How do I get that? Ah. <laughs> uh, oops. Uh. So I don't have any more runes. So I don't want their upgrades. Is that like here somewhere? There it is. The Storm of Urfail. Oh, I just need 2,500. No problem. Uh. Charge the power with melee kills. Okay, you press both buttons to enable it, but I don't have it yet, so it doesn't really matter that I know how to do it. Uh, oh, while I'm here, let's... Oh, it is here. Um, the thing I was trying to remember how to do... Was it this? Okay, tap B to stun them and then press X a lot. Okay, that was the attack I was thinking of, because I figured that might get me a lot of combo hits. Um, alright, so that was on my to-do list, it's now done, I'm not going to worry too much about the intel, let's go get another artifact. Ha 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 ha, oh, someone's coming to check it out, no oh, never mind, I'm not chasing after him, he's jumping down. Uh, okay, well, so what I wanted to say about other Lord of the Rings movies was at the very least, um, like, I don't actually know the the public opinion necessarily on the Hobbit films, uh, but I didn't think they were all that great. Um, the first one was kind of like so-so. Like, I had nothing against the actors uh, and the story. I feel like those were both alright, but, um... There's a lot of useless scenes. Like, in the first one, there was that part where they were going through a canyon. Like, I don't know if this happened in the books, uh, so that's that's obviously a big point, too. But they were traveling through the canyon for a little bit, and then, like, for some reason, the mountains just got up and started punching each other, and I was like, is this, is this actually part of Lord of the Rings? Like, uh-oh. Oh, I know that guy. We've met before. Uh, interesting, uh, because I think he's in my, Seen no, I've already passed the artifact. The last while. Bet we're gonna be shifting off somewhere else. Let's see, there it is. I was like right on top of it. I tried to grab those arrows. Alright, let's see what we got. A note, tattered note, a parchment letter sent from the outcast Aaron. Aaron. A Aaron. I'm guessing that's Aaron. It's just spelt in a fancy Lord of the Rings way. Uh, details her imminent capture by the Uruks. The note is clearly intended for Hergun, her husband and leader of the outcasts. Whether it has reached the intended recipient is another matter entirely. Alright, well, it's only two sides to a paper. My dear Hergun, I hide outside the camp and pray they do not find me. They are taking anyone they find into slavery. If only you were here. But I know you must fight the Uruks, or there will be no chance any of us will ever be free. I fear I will never see you again, if they find me. I do not know how long I can survive. Your beloved wife, Erin. Maybe it's following those two. I'm not sure. I can't remember some of the earlier memories. Uh... But at least two of them Kirk now have been about that couple. The iron jaws clumped hard on the people trapped here. The Dark Lord in all his forms desires sheer domination. 
Uh, hold on, is this episode running a little long? No, it's getting there. Um, it's fine. I was gonna end the episode now anyways. Uh, next time I might go stab that dude. Uh, let's see. Oh, I need to decide where I want to go next anyways. I was planning to head there. As I circle- oh, that guy moved. That makes sense. Uh, <laughs> dang, dang, they threw off all my plans. Alright, it's fine. I'm gonna try to kill- kill this guy. Uh, I guess I should check and see if I know what his weaknesses are. He just got promoted up to here. Uh, do I know anything about him? Nope. Uh, was there intel nearby here? Um... Yes, sort of? Let's try grabbing that intel. So I'm gonna, next time on Operation Picks, I'm gonna grab that intel just to see if there's any easy way to kill kill my old enemy there. Uh, and we'll come back next time on Operation Pixel, and that'll be our goal. 